Hi there viewers and gamers alike out there and uh, how's it going? So just I thought I'd make another video recording once again. So um, keeping it like above the 15 minute mark so hopefully I'll stay in line if you want to know. So I how is everybody doing? So for those who are watching this video that's previously recorded as in a premiere, just wanted to say hopefully I know I miss you guys miss me as much as I miss you. <laughs> so yeah. Uh well I already passed my first week of of chemotherapy and it's still not over. This is not over. Not by a long shot. So, chemotherapy to last from around somewhere between three to five months. Uh, if you're still wondering that, um, that uh, my friend Austin Lawrence is still waiting to know how to put up a video yet even though I hasn't done it yet but um, I'm just gonna make uh, I'm, I'm, I, I'm gonna check so I'm not saying he doesn't know how to I'm saying he knows it's just that sometimes he kind of forgets and because not everybody's the perfect human being so you guys are wondering how am I doing right now? Well, I survived my first week of chemotherapy, which I told you. And second was the next one was uh, nausea. Really bad, well, nausea. So yeah, no war, but a lot of diarrhea. <laughs> of all the rotten luck. <laughs> it's pretty funny, isn't it? Um, so, yeah. Uh, and uh, I thought that... Um, I know you guys are missing me as much as I miss you. And like I said, my entire channel is not dead. No way, no how, it's still on, it's not going to go away, and it's never going to disappear like that, like, disappear like magic, poof, it's gone, type of thing, no. Don't ever assume or think one second that this entire channel of Leo's Let's Plays Alliance is gone because it still remains. And it always has. I am a survivor. I will survive this. I will survive against testicular cancer. I'm still in the battle. This battle's already begun, including this war. Now you tell me that my that this entire channel has just not going too well. Oh, come on. That's a lie. I'm still alive. Still here. And I won't ever go away. Just because I'm not here doesn't mean I'm enjoying myself or having a good time. No, I need lots and lots of rests. Because of what I had chemotherapy for one whole week, then the next day for just one on a Tuesday. However, nausea was the... Like I said, nausea was the the killing machine that causes my stomach to throw up. So I wasn't trying to throw up. I was trying to 
keep myself <clears throat> intact as much and hopefully now that this is the month of November and moving on to December hopefully you guys will be able to have your very own Thanksgiving with your very own family from I know for those I mean because you want to have your very own Thanksgiving turkey dinner with your very own and no one else because you don't want to invite them well due to the coronavirus thing that's all around um keep it like just you your mom and dad and your brother and your sister and all that i would say um i would say a do it yourself you have your own thanksgiving thing without the very little or no invites If you guys love turkey so much, uh, that's really good because I am a big fan of turkey because I like turkey. Who would not like turkey besides chicken, of course. Um, I am allowed to eat beef and chicken and turkey, but I cannot have any pork due to chemotherapy, okay? Because um, it's no. It will always be a no because uh, it's not allowed. So nothing. To, uh, so I can't have anything but I can have anything but pork, which uh, that includes you know like pork, you know like bacon and ham and all that type of stuff. So yeah, that type of meat, I cannot have. I'm allowed to have beef, chicken, and turkey, but no pork. Be no no type of pork any type of pork for me is not good for me because uh, that's how it is and that's how my mom in real life said so it uh, you know the the things I really miss with you guys is my own method voice acting um i am taking a break on my own method voice acting i i know i want to do videos i i i know it's like really really hard and i really want to but i know you got you say hey if you're doing some videos how why don't uh, why not do it right now i mean i would and some of you may say uh um, just hold off a little longer and get some rest until you're ready. And I'm going to say, um, okay, um, I'll get some rest until I'm ready. So, yeah, that's a good thing. Until, once you get enough rest, you'll be able to record, even while you're on chemotherapy. And I'm going to say, okay, um, I'll, I'll take your word of advice that can work on my mantle. I mean, I'm not saying it won't because it would, it should, and it will work. And that's how it is. I mean, I'm not not trying to go over the edge because I will not go over the edge and like you like this and say, ah, no, I'm not. Oh, no, 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 that not like that. Still haven't lost my method voice acting. <laughs> so yeah. Um, if you guys have a question about my own method voice acting, I don't mind because I do it on my own terms. I'm, I, I, I pay attention of when I do, when I, when I, when I do, for example, when I eat, when I watch Batman Arkham Knight on YouTube, and I hear Kevin Conroy's voice acting, plus when I watch Batman the Animated Series, and also, um, especially, like, X-Men, Spider-Man, <laughs> yeah, and, uh, Batman, of course, 
and the things that are, those are for Japanese anime as well. Of course, like Sword Art Online and uh, Naruto, and also they yes, are Naruto Shippuden. If for those who don't forget, including dra uh, including the Dragon Ball universe. So yes, even though I'm. Uh, a fan of Goku and Vegeta, but not a fan of the others, of the actors who kind of, let's just say, not what it seems. So, I'm not going to go from, uh, I know who they are, but they are not what they seem. So, yeah, I'm pretty sure you know who they are, which I'm not going to say is where I'm going to end it. So, um, I, I do, like, I did, um, I, you know, doing your own method voice acting is, like, something what you happen to do is, 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 like, is an interesting experience when you do a recording and when you play a game and then you do your own method voice acting and then all of a sudden you do this and that and try to do the... And, uh, use the high low pitch of your voice. I think it was like the high low game without the pricing. So yeah, like the high low game. High, medium, low, or medium low, or medium high. Into that, of course, depending on which voice, which are, is your voice sound like. Uh, that includes singing as well, whether it's, uh, is it a soprano, an alto, tenor, a, berry, um, a baritone, if you want to know, short for Barry, B-A-R-I, period. So that's, it, like I said, depends on what type of voice method acting are you in. Um, it depends on the voice. Uh, as you get older, your voice may start changing a bit. Well, not by much, of course. I mean, what go what go what goes up but never comes down. And so for that, um, it is what I wanted. So you guys are asking, wondering. Why did I became um, did we wanted to become your friendly neighborhood spider cop in the first place? Well, why do you think of Marvel Spider Man came up with that idea by saying the name of Spider Cop? And yes, when the by the when the name of Spider Cop came into place on Marvel Spider Man because that game feels like Batman Arkham Knight and Arkham City because that game should not be a T rated game it should be close, uh, should be an M rated game not a T because who the stupid idiots say it's a T rated game because it has a lot more swearing than Batman Arkham Knight which doesn't make any sense wow how stupid are they. Yes, I get. Yeah, I can do a ranting right now. So, what kind of morons are they when they say it's a T-rated game? Because it should be in. Because a lot of swearing say, "Oh, it's a T-rated game with Spider-Man, but it has a lot of swearing, so the little, so the children are gonna play it." No, don't do that. Wow. How come they do not understand what is going on? And they bought the whole Shaz bagel <laughs> because because the ones who thought this of a great idea are idiots and more yeah idiots or should I say imbeciles by not learning because they went backwards because they don't know how to learn how to go into the colorful language barrier by saying this and that and then all of a sudden they just don't even care because they run out they don't want to have a guilty conscience like oh, it doesn't hurt but instead somebody does 
So, yeah. So there! Where's my wrench? Right here, right now. And there you have it. Woohoo! So, whee! Uh. <laughs> uh. 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 You know, that absolutely felt really good. If I say this out loud, we're ranting across the, you know, like, you know, the, from where I usually get to. And so for that, uh, it's, um, it, it, it goes to show you that things are not what it seems to be at Marvel Spider-Man. The next time they try to get a game rating correctly, they should be smarter, not stupider. Because they put the game rating is a stupid way by saying it's a T-rated game because... Bat, for example, uh, Batman Arkham City was very awfully close to an M-rated game, but they got to a hardcore T. The same thing to Marvel Spider-Man, which is absolutely awfully close to an M-rated game, and but they get it to a hardcore T-rated game because of a cutscene that looks like September 11, 2001, and others that are kind of almost nearly that gruesome because they have to cut it out and keep that, but it should not have been doing that because instead... They did that in the first place, and it definitely feels like Batman Arkham City and Batman Arkham Knight with Batman Arkham Origins. And that's why the entire game of Marvel Spider-Man is Arkham, because it's not a KID game ever. Ugh. Next time, why can't they ever speak the truth by saying this and that and no lies, but instead, they're liars. So, uh, okay, that's it for my rant, and now this. So, um, I do miss everybody, each and every one of those who subscribe to me, and for those who have not subscribed to my channel just yet. I mean, because like I said, I'm not allied with any big channels because uh, i rather stay the course thanks to my, uh, my closest friends who told me to stay the course, stay in your own lane is what he told me. And that is exactly what I'm doing because... I am not going to go back to one's big channel. I am not going to say this channel's name because I refuse to say it. Oh, and one more thing. Um, for those who say who cares about someone else's that no one, then I, I am that I care about that I care about that I don't care about anybody on, on someone else's channel on the, than just this one. Um, I understand, but however, it, it look, everybody has their fr very own free opinion, okay? So if they have their own free opinion, they have their own free opinion. I'm not trying to bother anybody. I, what I'm saying is that Everybody has their very own opinion. I miss each and every one of you guys. And not a day goes by when I think of those who are praying for me. For the battle against testicular cancer. Is, all, is still already begun. It's not over until it's over. I do have a bit of good news however. The good news is the masses inside me are dying. They are absolutely dying right now. So it is really good news. It is absolutely really, really good news. And because of that, 
I am, I feel like I am getting weaker, which I felt weak. I am weak. When I'm weak, Jesus Christ made me strong. When I'm blind, he shines the light on me because I'll never get by with my very own ability. How amazing to find that he still wants me so much. I want to stand on his want to stand on his truth and fight with his strength until he brings the victory. Because he is going to bring the victory and he will be glorified. God has mercy on my soul. Because he is greater. You will always be my family. No matter what. Each and every one of you. Because I love you all. I love each and every one of you. That I have a. <clears throat> some brothers and sisters. <laughs> A very own YouTube son, a, a YouTuber son, and I'm a YouTuber dad, and like want to be a YouTuber dad. And also, I want to have a you know one of my friends. I feel like he's kind of like the YouTuber dad I never knew, but I'm not gonna say his name. But I definitely know who it is. He's one special type of guy. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you do enjoy this following video and how am I doing so well and so far. And also, as your friendly neighborhood spider cop and also being a superhero is what I am. A superhero who fights in real life, battling against testicular cancer, Taking chances, making mistakes, and getting messy. Like peanut butter and chocolate and breakfast for dinner. Like a real life superhero. Because when the going gets tough, the job gets it done. Godspeed, play safe, and shalom. Remember to fight with honor, love, truth, and justice. And also, friendship is magic for everyone, always. And I hope to see you guys next time. Once I get better, one, and hopefully taking the advice is make it worthwhile. Thank you guys for watching. I love each and every one of you all. May God be with you, and thank you.